Hey guys, it's Postbox Pat and welcome back to the video and today I want to talk about free V-Bucks in Fortnite Battle Royale. Now I'm going to be completely honest with you guys and be completely open with this topic because it's something that everyone should address and a lot of people do need to know this and get it, kind of get it straight with them because it's not as easy as you think to get hold of free V-Bucks. Now from what I know, there are two methods of getting free V-Bucks and I have a video on that and them two methods are save the world which you have to purchase. However, it will be free in the future. And the second method is using a Microsoft or PlayStation 4 reward system, the official reward system, which gives you in-game currency or vouchers where you can purchase your V-Bucks. Now, I have a video on them, which you guys can check out, and it will show you guys exactly how to do either of them to get access to the free V-Bucks. But what is this video going to be aimed at? This video is going to be aimed at all of them scams out there, all them people out there who I want to just kind of just, not expose, but just trying to show you guys exactly what you got to look out for when you're trying to access free V-Bucks one to not get a virus two to not get scammed and three just to not give your personal information out to random people online it's something that really does frustrate me and it's seen throughout the entire Fortnite community i've seen it via twitter i've seen it via uh, youtube i've seen it via everywhere with videos and ads even people paying for advertisements for this to happen so i want to go into that today and kind of expose a few people not exactly expose but kind of point at a few people and a few ads and stuff not really going to name anyone, I just want to point at different things, and you guys can see exactly what I mean by that when I go over this stuff. So let's get right into this, and I'll show you guys what I mean by this, so that you can be careful within the Fortnite community and not get scammed, virus, or whatever happens with the personal information, you don't want them having access to it. So let's get into this and show you guys everything with this. First method I want to expose is this advertisement method. You will get sites like GameReward.com and there are many other sites out there which you'll run the run the site and what it'll do is it'll take you to the site and it'll tell you to play a game. Now what will happen if you will download this game and play it and the site themselves will get paid for you downloading the game, they will make a profit from that because that's their type of site and you won't get any free books at, free V-Bucks at all. So you're just wasting your time making the site money for download for basically advertising other apps and them ads getting kind of like plays or whatever and they'll make only a small amount but if a huge amount of people do this obviously their rate's going to increase so let's avoid doing that if you guys are trying to get free v-bucks don't do that method at all this method does not work 100% does not work unless you're using an official reward system like microsoft or playstation a reward system like this is completely pointless for example in this clip right now when he gets 1,000 free uh, 13,500 v-bucks it's clearly just him purchasing it off the stall and cutting it out so you guys can just see it there so it's it's just been frustrating and things like this do happen within the Fortnite community. So try and avoid this. Do not go to these sites. Don't try it because you're just wasting your time and you're not going to get any free V-Bucks doing this. You may as well be out there doing something else and maybe even buying V-Bucks yourself. So there's a bunch of different methods that I can talk about as well, which I want to show you guys. So the next one is Twitter. Now on Twitter, there are so many dangerous areas where people are tweeting about free V-Bucks consistently and that you think it's official Fortnite. But it's not because their Twitter logo is the Fortnite logo and also their Twitter is like kind of branded like Fortnite. So you think it is. It looks very similar to the actual Fortnite's Twitter. You kind of will fall for it every single time if you don't be careful on what you're clicking on. And what happens if usually these people comment on Fortnite and say and say stuff about like, I can't find any screenshots of it currently, but they say stuff like click here to win free V-Bots or click here to gain access to early early access on Fortnite Battle Royale or click here to do this, click here to do that. There's all these little things that you can do and you can like press and stuff and it's not officially Fortnite. So you have to be really careful. Don't click on any of them giveaways or things in the section down below because on, on Twitter because really you're just giving yourself like a way to people out there and you just get, they're just going to get money out of you basically. They're going to use you and the, it's not good. They're using you to like add revenue or whatever they're doing with it. They're using people to make themselves a profit and you're not getting anything out of it. So be careful with it because you are kind of being baited in with these fake misleading things and it can lead to viruses and stuff like that at late stages and you don't really want people knowing exactly where you're from and things because sometimes some ask for location and stuff and it's just not worth it. You're just giving your information away online for nothing. So please be careful when you're doing things like this. I know I'm kind of just... I'm kind of just out here just talking about it all and stuff and I know a lot of them have been getting shut down on Twitter recently and I've seen a bunch of them getting shut down but you have to be very careful like, I've seen loads of them still being tweeted and you, you've just got to be wary of what you're tweeting and what you're kind of clicking on on Twitter because most of it can be a little bit misleading so please be careful and click on the account first just to make sure it's an official account with a little tick uh, the best two accounts I know on Twitter for Fortnite are Fortnite themselves and Fortnite BR I think it's underscore BR. They're a pretty reliable account as well. They're a fan-made Fortnite account that does work pretty well. I think they're a really good source to be in, to know or like to know of because they just know a lot of stuff about Fortnite. 
So personally, them two are like the two that I follow, but a lot of others out there can scam you with free V-Buck things and stuff. So please be careful with that and just make sure you're not messing up too much with things like that. So let's move on to the next one I'd like to talk about is this. This is a method which is actually involving a glitch. Now I've put this on the screen at the top left up here just to block out the person's name and face. Obviously they could probably easily be tracked down as well, but just to make sure I don't want you guys like picking the wrong thing. Now in this clip here, you can see right now, you can clearly see that the person is using a PlayStation 4, which I believe this has only ever worked on. I've never seen it work on Xbox, but if you're on a PlayStation 4, you can do this kind of glitch thing where you like backs out, it purchases the item and you can uh, like you click close application and what it does it doesn't recognize the purchase but it still gives you the v-box now personally that is really scamming the game and you can get permanent banned for doing things like that as in from playstation and from fortnite or even both who knows exactly once you're banned from playstation i suppose you're banned from fortnite because you can't get online so that's the difficulty thing with the like this fortnite free stuff and i've seen it with many other games like clash royale with free gems and things like that and i used to click on them as a young kid and just wasted quite a lot of time downloading apps which weren't really needed and just all these things that were just really clickbaity i just couldn't get access to free stuff and it just really wasn't worth it so at the end of the day guys be careful what you're clicking on out there there is no really potential like guaranteed method of getting free view books apart from the ones that i said in my actual video so go and check that video out if you haven't already it's a really awesome video it'll be ended it'll be in the comment section and at the end of the screen uh, at the end of the video on screen so that's pretty cool but the last one i want to point out is this on twitter now if you're a big twitter user or instagram or facebook there's a bunch of different groups out there they're actually not real what they do is they tweet out stuff saying about like free v books click here and it's a really weird link you know you just don't click that link if you click that link you just know that you're going to probably get a virus on your device if you're using a certain type of device that doesn't have much protection on it and also you could potentially get scammed or anything like that so just don't click these links you see you see them straight away being posted on like fortnite's official posts and also some other people as well and they're just not real i clicked on one ages ago saying about you get free fortnite game here to try and get someone a free fortnite game accidentally and i went through so many things and it gave me like loads of links to download ads and stuff and uh, just download stuff click on these ads and stuff and it's just a big big scam going around in circles that currently is lying in the internet so this video i hope really has helped you guys out understand that there is no actual method of getting free v bucks within fortnite battle royale the only actual way of getting free v bucks is by doing it like with the, either the, through the reward systems or through save the world or actually purchasing them so the best way is the reward system that is a guaranteed free method and also through save the world is a free method because save the world eventually will become free so it is a big discussion which i really wanted to point out at you guys and i'd like to apologize for the earlier stuff in this video if you've watched it all the way through and you think my voice has changed the earlier stuff was recorded a previous day just because just in case you're a little bit confused like pat what's happened to your voice <laughs> but at the end of the day like this sort of stuff really does need to be like looked at and just you can't you just got to know when to like click on the stuff and when not to you only want to click on the official stuff you do not want to click on anything that's not official on youtube obviously videos you're not going to get a virus from watching a video but it's the stuff they advertise in the video if it's a robotic voice if it looks sketchy if it's not like an official youtuber maybe they have only got say 300 subscribers it's got a weird logo they haven't got any other videos they've just got free v book videos and things like that you just know that it's not going to be real but say for example you come across myself and you're brand new to my channel and you see my stuff you're like you you can trust someone more like myself or someone who's similar to me for example someone like Ali A or any of the other Fortnite YouTubers you can trust them sort of people because they are they know what they're doing and they respect the community and they're part of the community a big part in it but then there's people out there who aren't so you just got to be careful for it and I just like to be honest with my subscribers and this is what I'm doing I'm just trying to tell everyone out there that you know you've got to be careful with all these free v-bucks and stuff i just definitely think it's something that a lot of people fool for and just a lot of people don't understand it 100 percent what exactly is going on i know a lot of younger people i've heard many many stories of people downloading free v-bucks and trying to get access to them but it's really just not been working for people so you've just got to know when is like the right time and the right moment to get free v-bucks and do the right move for yourself and like when i say free v-bucks i mean like purchase v-bucks through the right ways like you just got to know what is right and what is wrong and it, it's not difficult at all you just got to be wary of everything apart from the official reward systems and the official reward systems are through playstation and xbox an official reward scheme where you purchase in-game apps and stuff and they'll give you in-game currency it's like a point system with the official xbox and you can also get point systems with any other things as well for example you could have a point system with tesco uh, which is a supermarket in the united kingdom maybe with walmart when you purchase products and you'll get free points and you can use them points 
months to buy in-game vouchers from Walmart uh, for your Xbox and then that basically means you've got free V-Bucks. Doing it that way unfortunately is the only way and that's technically the way that I was doing it through the Microsoft web but it can be done in any other supermarket or multi or big store like that and that is basically the only way you're going to be able to get access to free V-Bucks unless you own Save the World. So that is the only way. The best way of doing it is through Xbox themselves because there's like a bunch of cool stuff you can do and they are probably the best way of getting vouchers for it from what I've gathered. I don't know what the PlayStation one like because I haven't tried it but I've done the Xbox one myself and made about probably probably about £10 worth of vouchers in the UK, but I didn't spend them on V-Bucks, I just spent them on other stuff. And sometimes you can get given random free stuff as well through Xbox. For example, I've been given a few £5 vouchers in the past. I think I've been given four or £5 vouchers overall on four different accounts. And I actually spent them on the zombie DLC for Black Ops 3. Uh, or I can't, I can't remember what it was called, but it was the one where every zombie map was in it. That's what I purchased with that, so... It's pretty cool and you can get free stuff. You just got to be there and be there at the right moment and know what to buy and know not what to click on and stuff like that. Just be really careful. Don't click on anything that's not official and that's all I've got to say really. So I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. I hope you understand that V-Bucks out there, if you are looking for free V-Bucks, I know I might have clickbaited the thumbnail a little bit to get you guys onto the video. It was worth it to explain it to you guys because being able to explain something like this is big for the community and I think everyone needs to know about it. So I hope you guys have enjoyed today's video. Don't forget to leave a like, comment, and subscribe if you're new around here. And once again, this is Postbots Pat signing out.